Let's see how this looks. I used a uh, stain instead of paint. I got a little bit on the side there, but uh, that'll get covered up. That's kind of cool just the way it is. Little baby blue. W. Come on, baby. Let go, let go. There we go. kind of cool little detail all right let's finish her up so here's the board uh, I've got some tape on it already it's actually uh, this a big old roll of transfer right uh, adhesive vinyl I don't know transfer paper whatever you call it boom my first time using it I have used uh, this um, Oracle or mask film in the past um, the difference is the transfer right is just a single layer it's uh, rolled up like you know a roll of tape would be whereas the aura mask has a film on it um, the, also the bigger difference is that the transfer right um, that we've got on here now is about half the price so we'll see how that works next step is to throw a stencil on there trace it and then we'll cut it out. Boom. Stencils on. Taped strategically. Uh, now I've got to add these filler pieces to it. Nose. So a lot of people ask me, uh, where do I get those stencils? Um, you can just have go to uh, Office Max or Office Depot or any printing place and have them print out stuff like on a large format. What I did is had them print it out in color. I just went over it with uh, tape on both sides to give it a little bit of strength. And then I cut it out with an X-Acto knife. That way you've got some stencils that you can keep. Um, probably do a lot of badger boards. So it's something that I want to hang on to. So I'll keep Bucky and all of his pieces around for a while. All right, I'm going to trace all the inside pieces and the details. And then we'll get to cutting in a minute. It's hard to see, but... Nah, nah, nah. I traced the whole pattern onto here and now we'll try to cut it out with the exact with the exacto knife and uh, I think I'm gonna do the black first um, what kind of stinks with this multiple colors is that no matter uh, how I do it I'm gonna need to go retape a lot of things again and cover over the colored things Blah. so if I do the black um, that's the main outline and everything else will be a little bit easier to see so next step uh, exacto knife cut everything out All right, I sanded them down a bit. Now I put on another layer of uh, the transfer paper. And now I'm going to cut out uh, everything that's supposed to be red. I gotta do a lot of stripes. I'll go pencil those in. That'll be that.
Got some red stain on there now. I'm uh, going to uh, cut out all of the white and do all of his legs and the W and his face and all that stuff. We'll do that white. I'm going to use a paint. I'm going to rub it on and rub it off so it looks kind of like a stain because I've never seen white stain before. So hopefully this looks good. Uh, I've got the um, the uh, transfer paper on there now, the uh, transfer film. Uh, I'm going to take the X-Acto knife and cut out everything that's supposed to be white. So let's see how that looks. See you in a little while. Okay, let's see how this turned out. I uh, kind of put the paint on, I wiped it on, kind of as if it was a stain. Uh, I would still be able to see the grain in this. Here we are outside. I'm going to now put uh, another couple of layers of polyurethane on this now that we got the white down. It looks good. Um, this is kind of what I was hoping for. You can see now that we're outside in the sunlight, the red kind of almost glows a little bit because we used a stain instead of a paint. So it really has a little bit of a different look. Uh, I did spray, I did spray a coat of uh, polyurethane on already just like a spray paint kind of thing but polyurethane I did that because um, when you poly and then you wipe like with a brush over uh, the stain it kind of smears and streaks a little bit so I wanted to get one layer down of poly and now I'm gonna go and uh, use a roller to put some down and then a brush to kind of smooth even it out do I don't know three or four five coats. We'll see what we need. Let's see how they look in a few minutes. All right. Bye.